Hello and welcome to my channel if you're new here. My name is Stephanie. Thank you so much for clicking on my video And if you have been here before if you have seen my videos before, thank you so much for coming back I appreciate the support so much. So today I'm going to be doing a video. I've been so excited to do I've noticed that I've been doing tons of hauls So I would do want to switch it up and get some more vlogs going and more lifestyle videos I have been waiting to do this haul I've been getting so much stuff and preparing and I have been binge watching watching so many of these videos it's actually bad so that is a puppy haul and everything that i've got for my puppy i've kind of been putting this off just because i literally couldn't believe that i was actually getting a puppy because i'm so excited this isn't going to be my first dog i do have a dog i'm sure you guys have seen before if you've seen some of my videos i do have an australian shepherd but it's my family dog so this dog is going to be mine completely literally in two weeks so i thought this was the perfect time to do it i do need to get a couple of things still I have been got the food just small little things like that but for the most part I've gotten a little bit too much and I'm a little bit excessive with it but at least I'll be prepared and yeah I'm just gonna spoil this dog Ryan so it's a long intro let's get right into it I'm super excited to start off I got this basket from Target it was only $14 and it's the perfect size it's from the brand Threshold, and it's just a storage basket. I just got it from, like, the little household section. I just thought that it was super cute. I like it because it kind of looks like a rope, so it kind of just reminded me of a dog toy. So I'm going to just be grabbing stuff out of here and showing you what I got to get ready for her. First and foremost, the most obvious little water bowl i got this from home goods and yeah it was super inexpensive it was only like ten dollars and i think it's so cute i like that it's elevated since i've known that i've been getting this dog for a while i've been able to really take my time and make sure i'm doing my research on what she should have and just going to a bunch of different stores so i can find exactly what i want and then i got these little puppy chewer bones so this is for her to be teething so she'll start off with this one and then once her teeth are strong enough she'll graduate onto this one and then this one is just one that she eats so yeah it's from the brand nyla bone it's chicken flavored i've just heard really good things about nyla bone i thought this is a must i don't want her to be chewing on my stuff so get something for her to chew on also to go along with that i got her a kong so this is the puppy kong i got the smallest ones because my puppy is going to be super small i just thought i should get the petite one and yeah it's really soft so with this you just put little treats inside of it and it's an interactive toy so they say that you can give these to dogs whenever you want toys like plush toys you shouldn't always leave out for them to have access to constantly but toys like these like interactive toys that stimulate their brain are really good to have out all the time also keeps them occupied because they have something to do so it's nice if you can't pay attention and then I just got her also some plush toys so I got these from home goods as well this was $5.99 and these all just crinkle and they're super small and nice and girly and then I also got her this Snoopy toy this was $4.99 and this one is just a squeaker toy because I thought it's nice to have a lot of variety of toys. I also got her these squeaker balls. Every time I like bring out her stuff, my dog goes crazy because <laughs> he's like, why do you have toys and they're not for me? But yeah, so just these little squeaker balls, just like little baby ones. I got this little tug toy to pay tug of war. I read that that's a really nice game to play with them, to really interact with them and like get them bonding with you since you guys have to play together. And I just got this one from Target. It's the Boots and Barkley brand and it was just a dollar so super good the next thing i wanted to show from home goods as well is this bed this is called a donut bed i just like how nice and comfy and cozy it looks for her because she kind of just i don't know like sinks into it and this was only $19.99 so super good i know that they're usually like 40 50 dollars and this one is really good quality it's from the brand posh so yeah called the donut cuddler so i love this for her so much next thing i got her which is so cool because i didn't know that this was a thing but they have a chi for dogs what 
So this is a deodorizing spray and it literally smells the same as the regular Chi, which is so cool. So my dog's gonna be smelling fresh. I'm gonna spray this on like after showers or in between washes and things like that. Oh, I do need to get puppy shampoo. I haven't got puppy shampoo. And then this puppy is going to be hyperallergenic, thank God, because my Aussie shed is so much and when i had a frenchie he shed so much and it was awful so i made sure that i was getting a dog that didn't shed so i have this little brush so that i can groom her and then i do also want to get a grooming kit and try to learn so if i ever figure that out i will go ahead and make a video on that as well but yeah i just got this little brush it's a bamboo brush i believe i got this one from burlington coat factory and it was like three dollars i got this one from home goods as well this was four dollars this is actually one of the first things i got and these are just pet cleansing and deodorizing wipes hyperallergenic antibacterial and deodorizing non-toxic alcohol free so just nice for like i said in between baths or when i bring her inside and i have to clean her paws just have these on hand hi sweetheart you want to go say hi to my video look who it is come on <laughs> he's smelling around he gets really jealous Okay, the next thing I got for her from Amazon is just this water bottle. I thought that this was so cool and smart to have. There was a instance when I had my Frenchie to get super thirsty super quickly. So I don't want to have any instances with that. So I thought this was so nice to have. I get scared too. Sometimes I take him on bike rides and he gets so dehydrated and i get so scared i'm freaking out like he's like drooling from his mouth i'm like oh my god he needs water so you feel the water here and then you just press this button and it goes into the little bowl part there so they drink it from there and then if they don't finish it you just tip it upside again press the same button and it just sucks it all right back up that way you don't waste any water and then on the bottom it has a little storage too so if let's say you're out for the day you want to put food in there or even treats if you like training on the go you have everything that you would need in here so i thought that's super nice and i like that it has a little thing here super compact but literally can save your dog's life so I love that so much. I actually got these two today. It is a organic skin soother balm. It's just like the chapstick for dogs. Super cool. And it treats wounds, cuts, burns, rashes, fungal and bacterial infections, hot spots, and dry and itchy skin. And then I got a little nail polish pen. But safe for dogs. When I was little, I had... A dog that i grew up with when i was three and i used to paint his nails and yes he was a boy and i would paint his nails pink and i would paint it with my nail polish so i didn't want to do that again i got puppy nail polish i just got a white color probably got a bunch of different colors i know it's silly but i don't know what to say <laughs> and then i just have nail cutters for obvious reasons like i said i want to groom her myself just so i can do it exactly how i want so just have these and then i got some mini training treats these are just from pet botanics he's like literally licking his shawl i'll give you one sit paw down 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 bang <laughs> He goes crazy every time I bring anything out. But yeah, so I just got training treats. I just got this one. It was $1.99 again from Whole Foods. It had, I mean, Whole Foods, Home Goods, sorry. I just want to make sure that she's eating like the best that she can. I don't know if these are super good. I didn't really do research on them, but the back of it sold me. But yeah, I didn't, these are the only ones I got just because I don't know if she's going to like them or what she's going to like. So I didn't want to go crazy buying a bunch of food and a bunch of treats and then she doesn't like them. And then I also did have, well, I had this already. I had got it from Amazon for my Frenchie. It's just a little car seat so that when I have her in the car, I don't have her walking all around the car and being unsafe. It does have a little seat belt that connects to it too so she can't jump out from it just kind of makes me have a little bit more of a peace of mind making sure that she saved the car and i also did get a little blanket for her from amazon as well that i put in the car i'll insert a clip from the car of it 
I just put the blanket on, on the bottom of the car seat so it's nice and comfortable for her and then I read that or I actually saw it on a YouTube video that when you're going to pick her up from a litter you sleep with a blanket the night before that way it has your scent on it that way when you pick her up she's like getting used to it she'll feel comfortable and it's nice and soft I got it from Amazon it's a fur baby one it's for dogs I don't know what the difference really is for dogs but I just went with that one and then my favorite I got this set from wild one I saw them on Instagram a long time ago and I fell in love with it and then when I found out I was getting this puppy I knew that I had to have this for her I love the quality of this she probably won't be able to wear this for a while because this is what she's probably gonna wear because her neck's gonna be tiny but the quality is amazing super stretchy super durable the reviews were amazing on it and then it has this nice nylon leash for her and then it also came with this poop bag which also matches and it came with one poop bag inside of it so yeah I just feel like I mean she's gonna be wearing it every day I want her to look super cute in it so I love that and then I also just got this from Amazon and this is called a kibble bubble so I didn't think that this was gonna work since there's like literally no closing you kind of just push it open but you put their treats inside of it I'm planning on just training her as much as I can so if I'm not planning on training her and it's just like a random little training session that I want to take advantage of I just have this with me you put the treats in and then you just open it up and it dispenses it so I just connected it to this and the cool thing about this leash as well is that this clips to the bottom so if you want to make it a shorter leash you can do that so I love this they also sent me a little tennis ball for free so yeah and then they also have matching tennis balls within this color so I kind of want to get that but yeah I do really love this obviously I haven't tested it out yet because I don't have her yet but I think that the quality is amazing so far and then last thing I got is this little container I was looking for food storage for her I wanted to keep something small in my room for her that way I can feed her in my room and I found this from home goods I was actually looking in the dog section and then I wasn't finding anything I like kind of just had like glass containers and things like that not airtight and I just got this in the food section and it just has like a little nod so that you can lock and unlock it and it is airtight and I just thought it was a perfect size my dad helped me put a little bone with her name on it as well I thought that was super cute and purple to match all the rest of her stuff and yeah I just have my receipts in here just in case I need to take anything back but yeah and then I also just found this this by the way was $5.99 and then I found this little scoop for $2.99 super convenient just to have on hand with me in my room yes I love this I love that it's airtight I like that it's nice and compact and that is it I'm so happy to have done this video I'm so excited to get my puppy there's gonna be lots of content coming soon with her I'll make a video of when I go and pick her up I'm so excited I've been waiting for this for so long I didn't want to share it with you guys because I didn't know if it was set in stone but it is set in stone and I'm counting down the days I hope that you guys loved this video I have like I said been binge watching these videos and I just think it's so interesting to see what everyone has for their dogs but yeah I'll keep like I said updating you guys throughout the process of training with her and all of that kind of stuff and I hope this video helped you out if you're getting prepared to get a dog too like I said I'll go ahead and start making more vlogs I do love making vlogs I feel like I've been doing a lot of sit down haul videos I want to do more lifestyle videos and like always go ahead and leave down any video ideas that you may have below and subscribe if you haven't already you're already here you might as well subscribe I'm going to be posting every single Friday as always and don't forget to like and share thank you guys so much for watching this video today and I will see you guys next Friday.